right, ladies and gentlemen, y'all already know what time it is, man. If you like the video, like the video. Subscribe for more daily 2K content. One for the money, two for the show, three for each and every one of my gym stars. What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, Jay Easy, a.k.a. Fresh from the Barbershop, BK, the People's Champ, coming to you live with another video, man. Look, I ain't got a lot of time for y'all today, man. A lot to talk about, a little bit of time to talk about it then, man. Y'all already know what it is, man. If you order the shirt, the shirt's going out today. Everything, we got it in, pressed up, going out. Don't worry about it. You should have it in about three three to four days. About it. Let's just say by the end of the week, man. Hey, listen, man, because normally, I I, normally I can walk right into the store and buy what I want and then walk out because that's how it is. But due to the uh, due to everything that's going around with the Dos Equis things, man, it's nothing I can do. I, I have to just wait. I'm at the mercy of the companies. And you know a lot of these companies ain't shipping on time. But, you know. Hey, but. If you want to order some, man, hit up the site. Link down in the description, Breeze Tees. And uh, let's just get right into it, man. We'll talk about Breeze Tees after this, man. NBA 2K20. All right, look, look, man. After a long break, developers have now released a new update. We have full patch notes under the 1.12. Uh, <laughs> look, man. It just says there are no detailed patches, patch notes yet. And, uh, you know, this is what we got. Improved stability and general user uh, experience improvements. Now that can mean a lot of things. We got a uh, we got another joint from NBA 2K20 Intel, and you know that normally that normally right up on uh, right up on things, man. And it just says we just gonna go through everything. Addresses crashing issues. Brutusen put a video out there about last week, man. We stuff still crashing, still stuttering, still getting the thing. You know that that, that joint where it says uh, you've encountered a problem and you've been kicked out of 2K. Uh, you know, addressing and stuttering and lag, uh, latency like my dog Agent Zero always be talking about. Man, we got a runner. He need to let me train him or something, man. We both in Atlanta, man. What's going on? Ain't no excuses, baby. Uh, fixed frame rate drop and freezing uh, issue. Oh, yeah, if Duke want to play, man, holla at me, man. We can play too, man. Shoot, you in Atlanta sometimes. Shit, holla at your boy. Uh, fixed frame rate drop and freezing issues, performance and stability improvements, uh, added audio-related improvements, uh, and then other minor under-the-hood fixes. We're going to talk about all that stuff because that can mean a lot. Here we go. Uh, these are some notes from NBA 2K Intel. Improved, improved uh, improvements to double team logic for, uh, for hold on one second. Let me, let me do this real fast. Got to turn off something. All right. Imp improvements to double team logic for more appropriate rotations and to, and to prevent help defenders from leaving their assignments. Man, that's been a problem in 2K forever. You would go into my team and set it up to guard tight, Never leave. Ignore everybody. Oblivious. Don't help ever. And you can still drive in there and they're helping. They're kicking it out for a three. Man, I hated that, man. Like, if I can make my team play like that in my team, I'd still be playing my team right now. I never figured it out. Even using Sam Fam stuff, I never figured out how to do that. Uh, let me see. Enhance several dribble size up combos to make them more responsive when changing chaining moves together. That's cool, man. We all, most dribble moves ain't never been a bad thing. Improve logic for off ball collisions to prevent excessive bumping resulting in a smoother offensive flow yo i don't know how i feel about this man game already very offensively friendly after the last patch where you can just shoot in people's faces and heller whites are going in heller not hella heller whites are going in and heller contested shots are going in and let me tell you why that is they tried to fix everything in 2k is tied together man they tried to fix the logic for why my guy, who is a shooting center, but I can get pro alley-oops, why I can never catch an alley. I would always just catch it and do some shit like that or, you know, do a layup. I would never catch an alley and dunk it. And even if I did, it would probably be a, a person, it will be a guard around or something, and I'm going to smoke it. So what they had to do is they had to turn up the overall shot success rate and, and uh, shot success rate and shot success frequency and, uh, and contested shot success rate frequency to make it work. They're not... From what I understand or from what I'm looking at and just what I'm guessing, how everything worked out, they had to turn up that success rate. So the, 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 the alley-oop, I guess it counts as a shot, um, you know, a shot close, something like that. And it's not really a dunk. It's not a layup or something. So they had to turn up that success rate overall to make the alley-oops work. And it's like one of those things where they said in the beginning where everybody was smoking layups. I never smoked layups in the beginning, but hey, I'm not, I, hey, I, I, maybe the ones I smoked, I thought I was supposed to. But... They said if they turn it up any higher, then you're never going to miss. Now, this benefits me some because I'm a shooter, I'm a center, and I can just shoot in people's faces. Like, I've been shooting in people's faces all year. Like, we've been shooting over those all year, but, like, people don't believe that it's still in the game. If you can shoot, you can shoot. But 
we've been shooting over those all year, bro. And and look where we at now. Like it's it's the same thing. So the way that I'm looking at it is they had to turn up their overall success rate. Hopefully they dialed that back. But they're saying that they removed select dribble dribbler collision reactions that would slow down the ball handler uh when contact was made from behind. And then uh like like and, and improved logic for off ball collisions to prevent excessive bumping uh resulting in smoother game flow so that means i'm not gonna be able to bump people on back doors that means i'm gonna have to use off ball pests now because obviously they watch my videos because i put out a video saying that you could use if you had 99 strength you could use uh bronze moving truck and nobody could back you down really now i gotta use silver if they got back down punisher on on hall of fame it's fair but i'm just saying like the stuff that they're making it, they, they make changes they make one change and then it just changes everything man so like if if you not gonna really be i understand for the dribbler remove certain collisions and stuff like that for the dribbler what they need to do is remove some of the unpluckable animations and stop making you react so people can just spam 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 and then they're making you react you know with unpluckable all the time but hey it is what it is remove select dribble dribbler collisions reactions that would slow down the ball handler uh you know we already said that so i, I talked about that already offensive ai enhancement for better collision for better decision making when countering double teams okay i can feel that when you double team the, you know he, he don't just throw the ball away he'll actually find somebody um Fix an issue that would allow you to travel if you rapidly chaining together uh, rhythm dribble, dribble animations. I never saw that really happen. But dribblers, y'all might have seen that. Fixed an issue that was preventing players, pre preventing some players from signing a 10-day contract in the my GM or whatever. Never really saw that. Passes are important, so that so install it on your system. Blah 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 blah. Enhance several dribble size of combos to make them more responsive when chaining moves together. Like I said, man. Like a lot of this stuff, man. It's cool. It's warranted. But my biggest problem is anytime 2K changes something, it results in something else. So now, like you already get zero collision with Pro 2 when you're coming up the court. It doesn't matter. That move doesn't, doesn't sense collision. It doesn't see collision. There is no collision. It's just a straight up... It's, I, I don't know what it is, man. It just ignores all unit collisions, just like just like Hecarim. Hecarim's passive used to be, or, or whatever, man. It just it, it ignores all unit collisions. I don't understand that. It literally displaces people. You coming up the court, uh, 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 and the only choice that you really have is to just sit up under the rim and hope that you get a block or something like that. Then they do the dribble back, spin out, and they pull. Like, there's no defense for that. Could y'all imagine if this game was in the state that it was in the beginning, where it was like, where it was like you had, um, what did you have, man? You had, what if we had right now? Pro two, quick stopping, um, fadeaway threes horrible ass screens that that suck you in hop step and then what else and demigods what if we had all of that at the same time bro this game will be completely unplayable and i know i left something out too that was that was there on and the behind the back bro if all oh my god like i don't know if they changed anything i'm gonna be playing the game tonight me and brute we're gonna play the game today we're gonna see what's going on man but really like the way that the game is i wish that they would just stop messing with it man leave it alone I don't like I don't know if y'all noticed anything y'all let me know if y'all noticed anything But I'm just feeling like if they keep doing this We're going to end up with a game that's damn near unplayable pretty soon. You're already out there losing to bums That haven't hit a haven't hit a green since the patch or before and their shots are going in man It's crazy, bro. I don't know man. Y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section, man And uh, you know with the comment section like I said all the shirts are going out today, man But I want y'all to go over there you know, during these hard times, man, go over here, support the site, man. You know, we got plenty of stuff. We got the pump day. We got the, you know, we got the football shirts. You can tell me what you want. We got beast mode activated like what I got on right now. And the best thing about it is we've got, um, you go in here, choose your size, choose if you want dry fit or not. And then you can choose hoodies. You can choose, uh, slim fit hoodies and you can choose tanks and stuff like that, man. So you can do all that. Hold on one second, man. My dang on water cooler. It's tripping, man. Stop making all that damn noise, water cooler. And last but not least, bro, we got this joint right here where you can you can just put whatever you want to on the shirt. Your image here. We gonna find something, man. Look, the the, the drunk Uno. I, I don't I don't know what we just put on that. Atlanta Falcon. Boom. You got your Atlanta Falcon joint. You uh you size it up. Bam. Now you got your Atlanta Falcon shirt, bro. Look at that. Boom. Boom. Hoodie. Anything. Any logo that you can find if it's big enough, man. Put it on there, man. And you are. Good to go or choose from one of our many ones here. I just did one for my boy Gambit. 
Um, his shirt's going out tomorrow too, man. Y'all just let me know whatever you want, man. And then we got plenty of gym star stuff down there. I gotta get up out of here, man. Hope y'all enjoyed the video. I just hope the dispatch doesn't do what happened last time, bro. I just can't take this where they make a change and it changes everything and then it makes the game damn near unplayable for a certain group of people. If you if you as a lockdown or defender, it's like what why am I a lockdown or defender anymore? We still did people up, don't get me wrong. But shots that shouldn't fall are falling. And we're all benefiting from it, but it shouldn't be that way, man. Y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comments, man. Let me know what changes y'all have noticed. And I'm out of here. Till next time, it's your boy, Jay Easy, a.k.a. Fresh from the Barbershop, BK, the People's Champ. Godspeed!